child's brain is unique from an adult's brain and it requires specialized treatment. Helen DeVos Children's Hospital Pediatric Neurosurgery Program is the largest in West Michigan. And today we have Dr. Kava Asadi, a pediatric neurosurgeon, to talk about the program and the treatments that are offered there. Welcome to 8 West. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Tell us a little bit about what you do. It's a highly specialized area. So um, our specialty, uh, we treat uh, the entire spectrum of uh, um, uh, kids uh, um, uh, whose uh, brain or spinal cord may require surgery. And there we see um, a brain tumors, spinal cord tumors. Uh, we see a uh, um, significant amount of uh, congenital uh, abnormalities. Um, like uh, hydrocephalus where the fluid is backing up inside the brain or the uh, mm -hmm. um, uh, in utero or sometimes kids are born with uh, um, uh, closure defects on their back where the um, uh, spine for instance is not uh, all covered with skin that's mm -hmm. uh, what we help them out sometimes the skull is uh, uh, slightly shaped in a different fashion which makes it uh, uh, unfavorable for the brain to be able to grow and develop the way uh, uh, it wants to and so we see the entire um, uh, spectrum uh, um, of uh, pediatric neurosurgery. Yeah, um, if people have ever been to Helen DeVos Children's Hospital it is simply amazing the talent of the people that we have there to uh, care for our children, the facility itself. Uh, some people I've heard say it's the jewel that you never want to have to go to. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> because it's so wonderful. There's a team of experts in place and you work together really yeah. to provide top-notch care that yeah. you know people travel even long distances yeah. to come to Grand Rapids to be able to get yeah. for their family and their children. Yeah. Tell us about that team. So, um, so we are very, uh, very fortunate to have a lot of uh, um, uh, excellent uh, uh, subspecialties. Uh, and uh, nowadays, I mean, medical care, it's, uh, um, it's a team approach. So um, uh, one of those is uh, um, we are very fortunate to have an um, uh, intraoperative uh, um, uh, MRI uh, at uh, uh, Helen DeVos where we can actually uh, perform very complex uh, surgeries or brain tumor removals where we can image as uh, we are getting uh, um, uh, uh, doing a resection of a lesion and obviously mm -hmm. with the brain and uh, the smaller the child the more delicate you know the surrounding area of a lesion is and the MRI gives us the opportunity that uh, um, uh, we can actually like uh, tailor uh, the resection to minimize uh, uh, the damage uh, to the surrounding tissue and uh, here I see we're seeing you know one of the images this is the intraoperative uh, uh, um, uh, MRI which uh, um, uh, is being used uh, uh, the operating room is like next to it mm -hmm. and then when we do the surgery the child is uh, uh, being uh, uh, transported and uh, uh, into the uh, MRI machine we get the real-time results of, uh, of what uh, we're actually doing and then uh, tailor the treatment uh, uh, in real time that is pretty incredible yeah. the technology you're be you're able to use and it's really necessary when you think about your patients and how they differ maybe from some of the other patients that come to spectrum health you are dealing with the smallest of patients. What is an age that you might work with in your um, job or the span and, and why is that different from you know, operating or caring for an adult or an older person? Yeah, so we, we see like uh, kids of uh, any age. I mean we, we already start uh, um, uh, uh, um, evaluating patients uh, before they're even born mm -hmm. so um, uh, now that the, the imaging modalities are getting more sophisticated we get actually very detailed uh, uh, information what's happening in a child's body as uh, uh, um, is developing That's pretty and incredible. Then, uh, pretty much from the time point and they're bored or um, uh, even premature babies uh, mm -hmm. uh, who uh, may require surgery uh, we treat them and all the way up to uh, um, 18 Mm -hmm. And so this equipment is, you know, your patients are growing, changing yes, drastically yeah, yeah. under your care, yeah. which might be four years. It's very interesting and you need to have a place that has all the technology and the expertise, such as Helen DeVos Children's Hospital. Yeah. So people would see you mostly through a referral or something like that because of a condition that their child has. Of a condition that the child has and, uh, um, and we also uh, see um, 
a kids who uh, don't necessarily require surgeries like concussions like sport uh, related uh, uh, injuries and that's also like a huge team approach there are like a lot of different uh, people like a uh, uh, physical therapist and uh, speech therapist and uh, um, uh, our rehab team is very involved uh, in that too and uh, um, those kids uh, we tend to follow along uh, um, until um, they are back to normal back to back in school and uh, um, we make sure that uh, they're safe before they can uh, participate in sports again. Yeah, it's wonderful to know that we have a great large team of people working to help our families in West Michigan. So thank you for coming in. We thank appreciate you. it. Thanks for having me. We'll be right back with more 8 West. This is 8 West.